Well, more fallout from the Springfield sexual harassment scandal. Governor Bruce Rauner has asked former state representative Ken Duncan, who's been implicated in the scandal, to step down from an appointed post that Rauner arranged. But Duncan says he's not going anywhere. More from CBS2 political reporter Derek Blakely. Just moments after Ken Duncan settled in for his very first meeting at the Metropolitan Water Reclamation Board. I'm happy to be here. Well, thank Governor Rauner for appointing me. Duncan got a not too thinly veiled dressing down from the board president. We do not and will not stand for any form of sexual harassment, and our record is very clear on this matter. The reason this accusation yesterday from Sherry Garrett, a longtime aide to House Speaker Mike Madigan, who said In spring of 2013, former State Representative Ken Duncan approached the House well and said to me and another woman, I want to take both of you home and see which one will be the naughtiest. Duncan's response? Those are 100% baseless accusations. But Governor Rauner apparently didn't think so. After appointing Duncan to the board just last month, Rauner asked Duncan to step aside. I'm not resigning. Did he ask you to resign? Yes, he did. And you, you refused to do that? Those are 100% baseless accusations. Sherry Garrett's sexual harassment allegations against Mike Madigan's chief of staff, Tim Mapes, yesterday led Madigan to fire Mapes. Now, three female Democratic state reps are calling for an independent investigation of all House operations, including Speaker Madigan's office. But so far, no Democratic state reps are calling for Speaker Madigan to resign. That's the state of play right now. Okay. Thank you, Derek.